Item number, SCP-2678. Object class, safe. Special containment procedures. The access point has been resealed and disguised as a bookshelf. All previously scheduled explorations have been canceled. Description. SCP-2678 is an extra-dimensional space solely accessible to those holding Catholic beliefs through a previously barred door in the basement of the Siena Cathedral in Siena, Italy. A metal placard beside the door reads, SCP Foundation Department of Abnormalities. Those who enter the doorway will emerge into a small tarped outpost built around the freestanding exit. Inside the outpost is a biomedical laboratory refrigerator, stocked with samples of blood and bone taken throughout SCP-2678. Several audio recorders, ranging from wax strip models to magnetic tape machines. A computer terminal requesting Foundation credentials. All attempts to access it have resulted in rejections for insufficient clearance. The score for a choral prelude titled Sol Golgata. The incomplete skeleton, hyoid, hip bone, and both forearms were missing of a prepubescent male covered by a sheet on a steel table. Cause of death, unknown. The outpost is located on the outskirts of a 324.6 square kilometer city in Italian Gothic architecture style, comprised exclusively of cathedrals, palaces, and churches floating in a red-orange void. A perpetual rainstorm composed of human blood has covered the city since initial discovery, delaying navigational efforts and staining the buildings red. While appearing to be marble, chemical analysis of the structural material used within the city has revealed all buildings to be made of osseous material taken from male children between 7 to 12 years of age. No life, human or otherwise, has been observed to exist within SCP-2678. Despite this, all visitors have reported hearing a discordant, high-pitched melody echoing faintly from somewhere within the maze of buildings. Audio recording equipment malfunctions within SCP-2678, with such devices only picking up the sound of falling blood at an immensely high volume. Explorers who follow the melody will be able to trace it to an exact replica of the Siena Cathedral, with previously mentioned environmental changes. The cathedral is entirely empty except for a single pipe organ, which has had its longest pipes cut in half and the corresponding pedal boards torn out. Footnote 1. The longest pipes play the lowest notes in an organ, which would leave it only able to reproduce high-pitched notes. The pressing of a key will result in the mimicry of the note by a male juvenile voice, ranging from approximately 7 to 12 years of age, with each key having a unique corresponding voice. As with a regular pipe organ, the notes can be sustained as long as the key is pressed, though this will result in what is reported as an increasingly panicked shift in tone from the voice as their key is held down for extended periods of time. While the organ is playing a note, the blood rain will turn into water by unknown means. No matter how long the organ is played, the buildings will remain stained. Long-term testing of explorers and members of the research team has revealed several behavioral changes, tentatively believed to be linked to hearing the organ music playing within SCP-2678. These include a greater appreciation for choir music, increased belief in structured religion, increased faith in authority figures, higher levels of doubt to those of a lower social or economic status, a reluctance to report crimes committed by other members of the Foundation. Symptoms do not appear to fade with time. Addendum. Testing of the organ was conducted on December 20th, 2019, in order to determine the upper limit of its sustain, as no attached wind box could be found. The longest recorded testing of a key lasted 23 minutes, at which point the C7 key splintered beyond functionality. The remaining fragments were noted as bleeding for several days.
thank you all so much for watching, and a huge thank you to all of my patrons on Patreon. Special shout out to Everborn, Joe Light, The Bone Man, Tannis Ruler of All, and Doomsday LLC, Prince and Design. If you'd like to help support the channel, head on over to patreon.com slash drmaxwell. Link in the description.